Good day. Uh, welcome back to another uh, session with Down the Rabbit Hole with Building Inspector Steve Nason. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about finding ULC listed products or listed assemblies uh, and um, those type of products that are on the ULC uh, website. In the past it's been fairly hard to find them, but I think they've got it corrected now. It's just a matter of uh, going down that rabbit hole and seeing where to find it. And uh, so let's go and see what we got here. Okay, so I'm going to end, I'm going to end this one, title slide. And let's see. First of all, you've got to do a ULC product search. So that'll take a UL IQ trademark. Okay, so then once you click on that, that should take you over to a session. Join the login or join the product. So when you do join the product, there's a series of of items that you need to go through. Okay, so like if you join, there's a whole list of items and those, and then once you set your password, away you go. Uh, in my case, I've already joined, so I just go into login, and that'll correct. That'll take me right into here. So as you can see, uh, I'm logged in. Um, so then what we do is that you can go in your product directory and for example if we want to do a um, uh, ex there's exterior wall systems fire door and tested related certifications okay so that's where we'd find let's say we go into here and see if we can find I'll give you uh, an example of a uh, of one that we might be looking for so just a matter of hang on I'll get you a number okay so if we want to go in to see if we can find it uh, UL Design U385. So let's just go into here and try see if we can 385 three, I'm sorry 385 okay so then we're going to do a, a search okay so then that didn't bring that up so let's see uh, why that didn't work. Three, let's try 327 Okay, I'm um, not sure. Window and door. Okay, so that's why I'm in, I'm in the wrong category. Okay, so I'm going to return back to the dashboard and see building systems insulation. So, uh, fire and fire door. So that's why I was into fire doors. So you need to be into the fire rated walls and beams assembly. So if I go in back in here and we'll try that U327 and hopefully that'll work. There we go. So what I can do is then what we do is we'll bring that up and that tells me it's a 180 rated wire, uh, wall bearing, it's a low bearing wall uh, and that'll give me all the different uh, components within that wall assembly. Now what I can do with this one I can either email it or I can print it off. Sometimes if you, you then if you say you can print it off and you can print it as a PDF or you can save it or print it directly off. Uh, I generally save these and then print them off later. So again, that will give you a little bit of an overview, a quick uh, snapshot about that. So let's just go back here and we'll go back into the dashboard. Okay, once I find dashboard, I can go into dampers and I can look at nailer dampers, for example, air terminals, I can go into see what they're listing of so it gives you a one-stop shop which is pretty good uh, of all these ULs so if it's got a UL listed and I noticed down here on this one here Dock Raid Fire Stop Systems so again we have Fire Stop Systems within there that you can look and see uh, uh, there's Hilti in here and there's a uh, 3M so we just look in this 3M that talks about a Fire Stop System so this is a, a a great directory and they finally pushed it all into one so you're not going down there but again is a uh, as a role going to access the product and then you can either as I said you can either log in join the IQ where you've got to register but log in would be where you would have your uh, user and your username and your password already set up and if you want to join it then you have to do that so it's fairly straightforward Again, the website is UL Product IQ. And uh, hopefully that works for everybody. Take care and have a great day.